My name is Frank Furman. I'm co-founder and chief growth officer at PadSplit. We are an affordable housing marketplace um, headquartered in Atlanta, Georgia, and operating generally through kind of the southeastern United States. Um, predominantly in Georgia, Atlanta is kind of our flagship market at this point, um, as well as you know, Houston, Texas, New Orleans, uh, Tampa, Jacksonville, Richmond, Virginia. So kind of uh, a broad swap. We've been around for about three years. Uh, we've got 86 folks on staff today, uh, based in mostly the U.S., but a few overseas uh, people as well. Um, what we do is we work with, we're a two-sided marketplace. We work with landlords to take one unaffordable property and make it more affordable for more people. So the idea is uh, they take a normal single family home or apartment listed on our site, essentially rented by the room for workforce housing, create workforce housing units. So they work with us because we typically generate between 60 and 100% higher net operating income um, on their assets on these properties. And then the residents or, or members uh, work with us because they're generally saving about 50% on their living expenses by sharing the space. When we got our start, um, you know, this was uh, really, I guess about three years ago, um, we've been using a bookkeeper, we'd been treating our business in a very sort of traditional fashion and we didn't really have any customers. So it was, it was really kind of easy to do what we were doing and uh, fortunately we began to grow and add properties of landlords and these partners and we were faced with this problem of okay how do we actually pay people you know we, we started as this very traditional business with paper checks and the whole bit and you know we tell people hey, you know we'll mail a check to your office and we, we got to this point very quickly where we're like this is impossible this is insane we're never gonna be able to do it we were keeping our books, you know, I, I implemented Xero uh, for our accounting software. And all of a sudden I'm like, all right, I need to start paying people and I refuse to write a check. I just outright am not going to do it. I, I completely refused. And, you know, looked across the market, looked, uh, looked at a bunch of different solutions. And uh, the reason we chose Pluto was I looked at it and said, okay, well, it's integrated with Xero. It's super easy. I can just initiate the payment. Um, you know, from zero and then I'll automatically see it in Pluto and just approve it there. Uh, it was, you know, low transaction costs for, for the kind of thing that we were doing, um, which was kind of monthly rent payments essentially. Um, so yeah, low transaction costs, really easy. And essentially, you know, I'm not uh, really much of an accountant or, or all that handy. You know, I had it set up in 10 minutes, maybe probably less. So uh, it was just very easy. And, painless for us to do to and it sort of scaled with our business since then. Anecdotally, I would say a lot. I mean, writing checks is uh, just awful and uh, mailing things and, you know, all that stuff. I mean, physically impossible to do what we do today on, you know, thousands of units uh, with paper checks. But it definitely was a huge time saver and kind of really, really kind of fast. And not only that, I mean, there's the time for us. There's also the time um, that we save in getting money to people and you know having that money clear in their accounts so we we started using pluto instant very early on so we could essentially instantly uh you know uh transfer money so that we could pay people faster so they were happier so that was really saving people about three days of pop which was a big deal uh, for our customers cost saved i mean compared to say uh you know bills.com uh, several thousand dollars a month at this point I love Pluto Instant. Obviously, for us, uh, just the way that we're structured is kind of a venture-backed company. It's it's been very simple for us to stock our Pluto Instant account and and transfer out money as quickly as possible, which which has been uh, obviously a game changer for our customers and made it a lot easier for us in terms of reporting and getting reports out and, and making them happy. Uh, the other one is is really just the permission structure. Um, or approval structure, I guess. And, um, as we grew our team, again, I, I started as our you know kind of bookkeeper, doing everything from raising money to uh, approving receipts, kind of thing. But you know, we eventually hired a team that was much better at it than I was. Uh, but we still wanted to keep controls on who could approve what and send things out. And uh, the approval structure has allowed us to scalably, you know, let our team operate and. You know get things out and get reports out and so on and so forth but 
for example, any, anything new uh, or anything over a certain size, I have to approve, um, you know, us or our, our CFO. So um, it's allowed us to keep some controls on the business without kind of throttling and, and having to have everything go through us. So I, I really like that feature as well. For me, Pluto is the easiest, best integrated, most seamless way to pay customers direct through your accounting software. What I love about what I do is it's motivated by this really core conviction that the only way to attack the affordable housing crisis and to solve it is we make affordable housing possible by making it profitable. Uh, we're the biggest co-living company in the country, but um, you know we our ambitions are much more are much higher than that. Right now, we we operate regionally. We want to operate nationally and internationally. Um, you know, we want a big IPO or a big uh, you know kind of strategic acquisition. We want to be the Airbnb of the uh, workforce housing market. Um, we want to be the biggest in the world. So uh, we're that's that's kind of our goal. We want to make it so that anybody anywhere can um, can operate in this model and create you know a million affordable housing units in the country. So that's that's our goal.